Heavy snowfall from this winter storm just in time for your Christmas has broke a record. In fact, we are now the snowiest Christmas day on record, and we'll hold that record book at least for a year. We'll see what happens next year. But since midnight, and it's still snowing, we've had 5.5 inches of snow and that breaks that 2002 record of 5.4 so we'll see where this tallies up by the end of the night storm total almost nine and a half inches and still snowing so we're not completely done uh, with this event but it is on uh, winding down and we're getting on the back side this hefty snow has also added us uh, uh, snowfall totals up for the month here too we're up to 27.2 inches and that puts us through that top 10 list in fact we are now the third third snowiest December on record. It doesn't look like we'll catch 2010 of 53.1 inches, but 1987, we'll keep an eye on that to see uh, over the next uh, couple of days if we can catch that to make it number two. So keeping an eye on the snowfall, we're not done this evening. Still some snow showers and flurries out there this evening, and we'll continue to see those into tonight before tapering off through morning. Now I am expecting the heaviest snow to follow up in the snow belt as the night goes on. The rest of the area, just some blowing snow and some light snow showers. Uh, still an inch or less a possibility. Up north though, anywhere from one to three inches could still fall before this wraps up. It's going to be cold though. Temperatures dropping through the low teens. Those wind chills as cold as zero into early tomorrow morning. Uh, still a snow shower flurry around first thing tomorrow. Then those clouds will start breaking up. Staying cold uh, temperatures only in the low to mid 20s uh, tomorrow night for your Saturday night into Sunday temperatures slipping back into the teens. Uh, look for clearing skies for a while. That'll help that temperature drop. Sunday looks nice. Uh, sunshine around a few passing clouds and temperatures back above freezing. The melt starts into Sunday afternoon, but at the same time we warm up, the clouds will thicken up and into Sunday night. The chance of rain showers building in may mix with a snowflake or two, but overall uh, mainly rain showers expected on the light side into your Monday. So tonight down to 13, snow showers tapering off toward morning. Less than an inch in most spots, one to three in the northern snow belt. Uh, tomorrow, the chance of a snow shower or flurry early, otherwise a high of 24, cold day. Uh, more sunshine is expected, not only tomorrow, uh, but especially on Sunday with temperatures in the upper 30s. Uh, staying mild to start the week, that chance of showers uh, on Monday, that'll be gone by Tuesday, but we get cold again. Upper 20s under mostly sunny skies Tuesday. Scattered clouds Wednesday and up go the temperatures again just in time for your New Year's Eve near 40 on Thursday, but it won't stay long. In fact, temperatures start falling through the afternoon. We'll switch the rain back to snow and turning colder into your New Year's Eve with some snow showers around. And it looks like to start 2021, temperatures in the upper 20s with a chance of snow showers for your New Year's Day.